she talks about the pain scale and women classically under reporting pain. Uh And then Mm -hmm. when they do report pain, then it's like, oh, it's not that bad. And it just honestly, it just made me think about uh, I, you know, my heart attack was a year ago and going to the ER and standing for 10 hours. I was there for 12 hours, but 10 hours standing. Mm. And (laughs) there was a man who uh, stopped me if I told this story before, but a man came in maybe like five hours into my ER visit and I overheard everything that was being said. And he said, they said uh, the intake and the triage, what are you here for? And he said, fractured penis. (laughs) And I was like, come again. Like, and, um, and he was walking around like he just got off a horse and then I saw him walk to the restroom and realized that his sweatpants were hanging below his butt and his bare ass, his hairy bare ass was hanging out for all of the ER to see and was like, oh my God. And then he came afterwards, like walking again, like he just got off a horse and this man with a fractured penis and long story short, he was seen and then discharged, if you will, (laughs) released. Ejected. He ejaculated into the (laughs) parking lot, into the parking lot. And, um, but yeah, he was long gone. And then when I had a diagnosis 12 hours into there of you had a heart attack, I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Fractured penis was in and out of here. Like it, he he arrived after me. He left long before. And I'm like, and and here I am. Just don't mind me. I'm just having a heart attack. Yeah. No big fucking deal. Why was that? Do fucking you think? fractured penis. And don't you have to have a bone to have a fracture? I mean, I'm just, I mean, boner. Because and what bone. you didn't realize is they sent him to the psych board. <laughs> <laughs> right outside your door is your smoking jacket. Go hop in that smoking jacket and we'll take you down the hall. Um, but, yeah. Uh, that's that's not that's not cool. But, you know, I'm so stupid. This is how I think the world works. You're number 12 in line. So yeah, they just call know, you one, right? two, three, four, five. And how did he have, how did he jump the line? But not that it's a male, female. That doesn't, maybe I'm super ignorant. Well, triage in an ER, there's yeah. a reason that like nurses do it, that it's not yeah. just like, you they know, someone needs, saying take a number. Yeah. They assess who. And um, when I was at the gynecologist for like regular exam last year, and I took, and the gynecologist said, oh, any medical history, anything big happened recently? And I was like, had a heart attack. And um, then I was telling, and she was like, what? Like, cause she's known me for 110 years and delivered my babies and whatever. And um, I told her about it and I told her the fractured penis story because that's kind of like my cocktail party <laughs> story <laughs> these days. Because, yes. It's a good one. You know, yeah. it's, it's just outrageous. And she said, People and I was standing up for it. <laughs> I said, yeah, an old fractured penis went in, you know, before me. And she's like, well, a fractured penis, that's very serious. And I was like, are you <laughs> what? <laughs> but she's like, you could die. Like, um, so I guess it is a real thing. And really? Yes. I Googled it at the time. I wasn't that interested. So I did not retain the information. Um, but yes. Now for everyone's frantically Googling fractured penis. Right. Death by fractured penis. <laughs> right. How does one fracture a penis? Yeah. Oh, God. Viagra? Was Viagra involved? Unclear, but the woman that he was there with did not look like. Fractured? Well, she didn't Satisfied? look like. <laughs> she didn't look sexual in any way. In any way. And I, so I was trying to suss out like the relationship. Is this his mom? (laughs) Is this his girlfriend, wife? Like I could not, I couldn't get clear on it. Oh my goodness. So I'll never know. What was the age range of these people? Were they young? He was like thirties. She looked older, but I'm not sure if she would actually was older or was just dowdy sort of. (laughs) Oh my God. Judgment in the ER. I know, right? (laughs) Right. That's crazy. No, I don't think you've ever told us that story. No, I I do not remember that that story. I think at the time I was, I mean, I was joking a lot like at the time because I was, you know, trying not to think about 
the fact that I just had a heart attack. But um, so I told that one so often, I probably didn't tell it amongst you because I just figured that I would told everyone that I knew. Yeah. It's like, oh, I mean, my uh, my daughters bring it up sometimes. Like, oh, remember the guy with the fractured penis? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's a memory. That's one you won't Core forget. memory. Yeah. I know you'll be on your deathbed. For better or worse. <laughs> Remember the guy with the fractured pants? Thank God I didn't have to see it, though. Like, yeah, right. Yeah, right. You Almost. Saw the ass was enough. <laughs> right? If those pants are dropped a little farther down. <laughs> Cha-ching. How do you even know you've fractured your penis? <laughs> no idea. Bert one time thought he'd ruptured his testicle on oh trip flip. And was text, frantically texting me pictures <laughs> of his balls <laughs> to see if I thought. And I was like, wow, never thought I'd be here. Oh.